If you are playing Fortnite with low FPS and lag, so through this in this video, I'm gonna show you how you can get maximum performance and more FPS in Fortnite with your any PC or laptop. So guys, in this video, we're gonna cover the best Windows optimization, the best power settings, and some important tools you can use for getting maximum FPS out of your PC. So guys, with wasting any time, let's dive straight into our this video. So guys, in the very first step, we are going to set up the power throttling and power settings on our Windows. So for that, press Windows R together from your keyboard and type here gpedit.msc and press enter. Now go for computer configuration, administrative template, go for system, now scroll down and find power management. Go for this folder, there you will find our power throttling settings, so open up power throttling, now go for turn off power throttling and double tap here. Now you need to enable the setting for turning off the power throttling and then hit apply and click ok. Once you're done with the settings now, go back into the main directory of this file, again open up computer configuration. Now go for administrative template, now go for windows component and there you will find our app privacy. So go for this option, now scroll down and there you will find the last window app run in the background. So again double tap here, enable the settings for turning off the app from running in the background. Now go for default for all app and set it onto the force deny. After that hit apply and click ok. And now the next step you need to download these files on your PC, link available down in the description and you can download them from my official website. So guys in the very first step here we got high priority file for the Fortnite. So open up this folder and inside here you will find out two registry for default priority and for high priority of the Fortnite. This will help your CPU and your GPU for running the Fortnite on its maximum performance. So guys you go for high priority registry, double tap here. It is. So guys now the next step you need to open up the shutup 10 on your PC and guys here you will find out this exe file you don't even need to install this application so simply double tap and open up this application on your PC. So guys now the very first step here you will find out the private settings for your windows and guys you can also do it manually but you can simply go for this action button and there you will find out apply only recommended settings because we don't need to disable any important settings on our window so therefore just go with apply only recommended settings it will ask you for creating a restore point but it is not necessary because all the settings are safe but again it is your personal preference you can go with the yes or no but i'm going with the no button after that guys this will apply the settings now you need to scroll all the way down here you will find that multiple settings has been automatically applied onto this application and now you can simply close out this application here you will find out this kind of the notification like some settings were changed which required a system restart so guys you need to also restart your windows after applying all the settings on your pc so click close so guys now the next step we are going to configure some important windows service settings so guys for that you need to go for your task manager right click here on your task bar and open up task manager now go forward to service tab there you'll find all the windows service and you need to configure the service on your windows so for that go for open services and now select any file from here and press s from your keyboard and you will find out here this s category now you need to scroll down and find this option which is this is main so guys you need to disable the service on your pc like i already have disabled this on my pc so right click here go for stop first of all after once you stop this application now go for properties Go for start type and set it on to the disable then hit apply and click ok and so guys on the final and the last step we are going to configure the best power plant settings on our windows so guys for that go for your window search and search for power and sleep settings open up your windows power settings go for additional power settings so there you will find out the available power plant on your windows so guys here i have activated with some high performance on my pc but most people have high performance power plan by default on their windows so guys go for this power plan now you need to go for change power plan settings Go for change advanced power plan settings. Now you need to go for the hard disk. Now set it on level 0 minutes. After that, scroll down. Now go for processor power management and click on this expand button. Go for minimum processor state. Set it on the 100%. Now go for maximum processor state and set it on the 100%. After that, hit apply. Click OK and save this power plan on your windows. Now after applying all the settings on your PC, now you need to one time restore your PC there for all the changes to take effect. After that, launch your Fortnite and enjoy the maximum performance with the highest FPS without having any lag on your PC. So guys, I hope so you love this video. Please make sure to drop a like, subscribe to my channel and till the next video. Peace out.